It's your boy, Kenny Boulder, with another amazing episode of pulling some Pokemon cards tonight. And we got ourselves a big, big treat. So I was very lucky and able to go to a local Barnes and Nobles and look what they have. They got a Battle Styles Elite Trainer box. So these are really hard to get right now. Not as bad as Shining Fates, but still bad enough where that, you know, this whole craze is still really holding people by the balls, so to speak. So I'm able to get it. I'm really excited to open it tonight because uh, this is the three, 350 subscriber special. Um, long story short, y'all, we've we've gotten pretty decent uh, views lately, and not just because of the Walmart thing, but other things as well. And I'm 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 <laughs> I'm not proud to announce, but I made a TikTok and I got like 10k views with like two videos I made before. So hopefully some of that kind of like sprinkles, and you know you got to double dip. You know what I mean? You got to double dip and get in that sauce, especially for those views. Because I mean, how else am I gonna boost this? So. Uh, Walmart, yes, Walmart, <laughs> and oh my god, oh my god, tomorrow, chat, tomorrow is Walmart day, Thursdays, 7 a.m., and I'm gonna bring a GoPro, I'm gonna put the GoPro on, I'm gonna go in there, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what the fuck's gonna happen, because again, it's gonna be crazy, woo, 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 excuse me, excuse me, y'all, I have to cut that out. Anyway, we got some exciting stuff. It's gonna be a great time. There's a lot of content around the corner. I've, I've been making some skits lately. Uh, there's a new video of me opening my first pack, Charizard. So that was an awesome skit we opened up recently as well. And another big skit that I did uh, a couple days ago, recording, and we're just editing it right now. And by we, I mean me, I'm, I'm editing it. Uh, one man show is a April Fools video. So I hope you guys enjoy it. That's gonna be out uh, tomorrow on April Fools. So let's go, let's let's uh, let's get in here. Let's open some cards. So here we are tonight guys, again. Oh my God. There we go. So look at that chat. This is a, an elite trainer box. It's beautiful. We got Sword and Shield Battle Styles Elite Trainer Box with a nice big boy right here, and this is this is again, it's a red one. Uh, there's a, there's two versions. There's the red and the blue. I mean, it comes with the same stuff really, but the red one definitely is uh you know red red's a powerful co uh, color. It's empowering. It feels good, man. So uh, definitely definitely get some good vibes on the red ones. <laughs> so and again, I got this in Barnes and Nobles. I got this at the motherfucking Barnes and Nobles. And I don't know about y'all, but trying to find any cards right now is virtually impossible. I mean, I talked about this before, but the craze has gotten even worse. And not like not so long ago, there was a guy who came in and he literally just bought everything. And I don't I don't do that. I usually buy one per because I usually try to get enough content. But if I want to be honest though, um, you know, there's scalpers there. I'll buy what I can get my hands on because you know, maybe this sounds a little bit edgy, but like, if I don't get it, the scalpers get it. <laughs> and if the scalpers get it, they're just gonna sell it to other people. So, and I know, just ah, uh, I, I don't want to keep being like the cycle. You know what I mean? So, I hate to say it, but sometimes, like at that Walmart, I will buy things that are limited supply. So, it's how the world works. Anyway, moving on. Sorry about that, chat. So this is completely contained. Uh, I don't see any like hampering. It's like pretty much sealed. And anyway, let's, oh, let's let's read us here. You got a elite trainer box battle styles. Uh, choose your battle style wisely. Be a titan full of power, or strike with impossible speed. It all depends on your martial mastery. Channel the power of Pokemon V like Mimico V, Trinitar V, Empoleon V, and more. You'll also find a handful of impressive Pokemon V Max, including Giga Tran, Giga Little, Giga Little Max. Urshifu in uh, both single strike and rapid start styles unleash epic smash ups of the Sora and Shield Battle Styles expansion. Right off the bat, in this box you get 8 packs. Uh, normally these things have like 10, but I know these prices have gotten a little bit down, I want to say. I think it's like $49 now. Uh, 65 uh, sleeves, energy cards, uh, player's guide, uh, rule book, 6 damage counter, dice, 
two, two acrylic condition markers, a collector's box to hold everything with four dividers to keep it organized, and a card code for the Pokemon training card game. And again, you can tell this is nice and minty, and again, no kids. Zero three, no, no veto. <laughs> so let's, let's open it up, let's go. Let's get this unboxing down, y'all. I'm excited. Again, this is our first Elite Trainer Box in like, I want to say months. I think last time I opened was like, probably like a Vivid Voltage? Or no, Shining Fates. Shining, Shining Fates in February. So, the last one we opened was a Shining Fates Elite Trainer Box. So this is uh, exciting stuff here. So, six and up guys. Remember that, six, six and up. No kids allowed. This is uh, Adult Swim now, y'all. <laughs> so, let's go right off the bat. Slide it off. Woof. Nice and easy. So straight off the bat, you get a little rule book. Nice, player's guide. Uh, it comes with the game, how to play the game, and some cards as well. Let's see if we can find the ultra rares. Okay, so we want the trainers, as always. Uh, you know, there's the trainers are really good. Uh, you know, rainbow rares are always fancy. But then you have the gold cards. I've been told that the Hounder gold card that's what people are really wanting to get this time around. So, we see that. That's our, uh, that's our, uh, that's what we're gonna get. Who's my favorite trainer? My favorite trainer is probably gonna be, ooh, that's a tough one. I mean, a part of me wants to say Misty, but, uh, I wanna say I personally enjoy, um, Brock. Because Brock is like a fucking champ, dude. All he wants to do is to find the love of his life and to bring her home. To, to help his sisters. Remember, it's help his sisters. How about favorite in this pack? We'll find out. I'll, I'll tell you what I'm gonna find out. Also, uh, BJB. Oh my god, I can't say your name. Kobe, gonna see ya. Doggy, doggy time. Thanks for joining. Appreciate it. I butchered your avatar name. Also, shout outs to uh, Biggie Blee Blee Blee. Shout outs to her. There you go. Alright, the box. Alright, so again, the lid. Battle Styles, train card game. Look at this nice little Ursufu. Uh, lol, I mean, that's my bad. I got you, homie. Thanks for stopping by, I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, this is, uh, you know, this Ursufu is very, uh, he's very intimidating. He's very intimidating. So, let's see, okay, more stuff in the box. So, you get yourself a train card game rules to play the game. Nice. It comes with all the little symbols there. You get the dice. Oh wait, so you get the the counter here. You know, Band-Aid and Death, I guess. I don't know why Pokemon has a skull there, but hey, got a skull. Yeah, show the kids that it means it's dead. And you got some dice for damages. Made in China, a classic. Pretty cool dice. Let's see here, what else you got here for me to unpack? So I'm just gonna take this off here. A little little divider here. Here's the dividers, again, four dividers, again, with the awesome art. This Ursufu VMAX is pretty fucking baller, but you ask me. I mean, unfortunately I don't play the game, but I, I do appreciate the art and the, the stuff they give you in the boxes. So you get four of these guys here to put your cards and divide them. You got yourself a deck of energy. Nice big deck right there, I think 70 cards, right? Something like that. It's a whopping deck of energy cards, so pretty cool stuff. And then you got yourselves your little sleeves here. 50 sleeves. Or sorry, 65 sleeves. My bad. I can't I can't read. 65 sleeves of the Urso V Max here, and pretty cool stuff. Again. Um, I don't really use the sleeves because I got my own sleeves. I got these cheap ass sleeves I put in. But I know people collect them and people use them all the time, so. Uh, and again, full disclosure, chat. I do not, do not, absolutely not scalp. I buy what I can open, and that's really it. I buy what I can open. So, again, I know we talk about the price. We always put the net numbers there. It's just good to know. I like to know the price of cards and the rarity. And that's it. The grand finale, obviously, is all these packs here, okay? So, you get yourselves eight amazing. Battle style packs. You got, you got a club penguin right here, and then you get all the other stuff. So eight packs total. Look at that. Club penguin, uh, bear boy, uh, shark man, 
uh, shark, or uh, uh, dinosaur, and uh, yeah, these are all the packs you can get. Interesting. And again, this was about $49, so not a bad price. You're basically getting a lot, decent. Uh, dollar per pack, maybe like 480, maybe almost close to $5 per pack, but again, you're also getting a bunch of other cool stuff as well in these Elite Trainer boxes, so it's always worth it if you can get marketplace value. If not, absolutely not. Do not pay a scalper unless it's marketplace value because you're just literally feeding the, you know, unfortunately the travesty of the current marketplace. Anyway, I'm sorry. I, I'm, 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 I'm rambling a lot tonight. I apologize. Uh, we're trying to do a quick episode because uh, I'm a little weary, but that's okay. So the first pack of the night, we're going to save this guy last, okay? As always, chat, we save the last, the best for last, or the first for last, whatever the fuck that means. So here he is, hiding over here. We're going to save him last. Penguin, call Penguin Pokemon. All right, first pack of the night, y'all. First pack. Let's see. Let's see what you have for us. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, Club Penguin. I love Club Penguin. Ripping pieces, by the way. That, that, that server that website closed down recently, too. So ripping pieces. All right. Pretty sure it's forward to the front, but we'll just do it just in case. Forward to the front. All right, chat. Let's go. Uh, ground Energy. Indy, again, this it's not a psychic type, it's a normal type Pokemon, who apparently is an emotional Pokemon, who gets to make tea and is pretty chill. Again, a humanoid Pokemon. These are always so weird. Let's go! And you can see like, uh, you know, a, uh, a Polygeist, I think, Pokemon right there as well. And they're just having a great time making tea. So, I guess these are very uh, tea-friendly Pokemon. And again, I don't know why it's uh, not a psychic type, that's weird. A Phoebe, nice, Phoebe, very cool. I like the outfit, you know, that Hawaiian kind of style. We like that, because, you know, we love the art, but that's a, look at that waist though, holy shit. That's just like bone, there's no meat. Girl, you gotta eat, man. You know, T friendly remind Pokemon, number one Pokemon. Oh, okay, okay, okay. og Sun likes, uh... also, y'all check out og Sun as well. He and I co-host a podcast called a slice of bread cast every Saturday at 8 p.m. Mountain time. So Phoebe, you gotta, you, gotta eat, you gotta eat a little bit, you know, you feel me, fam? I mean, good figure, don't get me wrong. A Carnivine Rapid Strike Edition. What the hell is this? Look at this thing. This thing is terrifying. It reminds me of like, that plant from like Little Shop of Horrors, you know? Like, it'll like eat people to like get bigger. It's like, feed me, feed me. This is it right here. And I don't know why, this is a Rapid Strike. It's like... Definitely, will, it looks fucking rapid, okay? It'll definitely fuck you up. <laughs> uh, yeah, Carnivine. Little Shop of Horrors Pokemon here. Murkrow on the Gravestone. Classic. I just I just like this. Aesthetically pleasing, you know? It's just, you know, a, a Murkrow on some graves. It's like, what are you gonna do about it? Uh, you got Horsey spinning some water out. A lot of Pokemon art cards always has horsies in the background. And they're usually always, like, spewing water from its mouth. So, I'm glad this horsey is doing that right now, you know? Classic. Uh, you got a Chir uh, Chiribi? Chiribi? Chiribu? Chiribu doesn't sound right, but uh, I'm gonna roll with it. Again, sleepy little sad brother and happy uh, I do all the work brother over here. So, cherry Pokemon. And you got a Lickitung. Oof. Oof. Lickitung. Uh, it's, a, it's a very terrifying Pokemon. Lickitung is like so fucking scary. Again, just imagine seeing this guy running around with his tongue out, like, that's terrifying. Like, it touches the ground! You don't know where it's been. But... Electro Buzz, a classic Gen 1 Pokemon. Charging up that energy, I feel amped up, you know what I mean? And he is, like, he's definitely amped up. Jeez. Uh, thank you, Electro Buzz, being extra luxurious to see the... Oh, look at this here! Luxio Reverse Hollow. Yes! Rapid Strike. And, oh, spoilers, um... Not much to talk about this. I, I mean, I got this last time as well, so you know it's good to get duplicates. But yeah, that's what we got so far. And the second, or second, last card. Jesus, I'm I'm fucking frazzled tonight. <laughs> last card of the night is gonna be a holographic yes! octillery. Octillery? Yeah, little octopus boy. Look at that rapid strike octopus. Okay, so he is ready to kick some ass. Look at that octopus are very delicious and they're apparently very intelligent as well so every time i eat octopus at you know a sushi restaurant i feel really guilty but this guy though is definitely certified badass look at that 
smartest octopus out there, you know what I mean? I still don't understand his evolution, though. I don't understand how this, like, Rimoroid becomes this guy, you know? Taco- oh, Takayaki's so good! Oh my god, chat! Yo, Takayaki's so good! No, no, it's so good! Takayaki's, like, the best. The best. Whenever I get a chance, I eat Takayaki, and, you know, the, like, the, the fish flakes on it? Ah, oh, so good, so good. It's a Digimon-style evolution. I mean, it basically is. Jesus. All right, pack number two of the night. Woo! Pack number two. Battle styles. And this one's with the bear this time. Let's go. Okay, Doki. Let's get rid of the, this guy. And this guy. Forward to the front. Let's go. All right, energy. Green leafy energy. You got a heat more. This little fucking... What the hell is this? It's like a pipe. This guy looks like a joint. Or like a bong. Heatmore, you look like a bong. Like, if I blew stuff in here, like, stuff comes out. What the fuck? They, they must have known what they were doing with this Pokemon. It's like, okay, we're gonna draw some art. And we're gonna make a bong out of this Pokemon. I don't know why he's built like that. He built weird. He built like a bong. <laughs> I mean, that's... that's a, it's a, it's a ant eater Pokemon. But where did the ants go? Is this where he poops? I don't fucking know. I don't know, this is so weird. <laughs> Alright, next card. Scroll of Scorn. Dang. Look at this, single strike version too. It's like all this chain over here, just containing all this hate and malice and the scorn. Furious anger. Oh wait, this does damage? What the fuck? This is a trainer card that does damage on Pokemon. That's fucking terrifying. Uh, Bisharp! Okay, okay, okay. We got Bisharp right here. If, uh, <laughs> if Gooding's in the chat, look, I found your favorite Pokemon. Look, it, it's Scissor Man. You know, again, uh, Scissor Man's pretty cool. I don't know why he's in Pokemon, but Scissor Man's here. Or Cut Man, that's right, he's Cut Man. <laughs> he's Cut Man, just running around being like a cut guy, you know, having a good time. You know, I like that. I like that about Cut Man. Just chilling. Nothing wrong with Cut Man here. Um, next is gonna be a Spearow. Spearow is again Gen 1 Pokemon. Classic. And I like the art style in the background. It's just, you know, it's just a town, you know? Like, you you, you would you would imagine Pokemon like, like these all over a town. Because they're just like, you know, they're like Spearows or whatever. Not Spearows, that's like an evolution. They're Sparrows, there you go. Fuck. Sparrows. Uh, next is gonna be. Oh! So kawaii. Pachirisu. Pachu. Pachiraisu. Pachiraisu. A, a electric uh, a Ela squirrel. Well, okay. Sounds like e-girl right there. E-girl Pokemon. Hats off to you. Uh, yeah, dude. Hats off to you, fam. I think hats off to you is like a shout out. So Zoof Zoof, thanks for stopping by. Really appreciate that. Hats off to you. <laughs> you should do the dab one. I'll do all. I'll always do dabs. Okay. Uh, cute Pokemon. I love it. Running around, having a great time. I mean, you can't complain about that. Next is gonna be a Chirby again. A mind foe doing the splits rapid strike. Dang. Dang. Oh, thanks for doing, doing the mukbang challenge. We're, we're getting that. I think we're at 50% now, by the way. Uh, this mukbang, or sorry. Oh my god. Mind foo. <laughs> mind foo is definitely a boss. You know, who the fuck can do that? What kind of Pokemon just like flexes on other guys? Like, okay, I'm just gonna, you know, do a splits in front of everyone. You know, like, check this shit out, bro. He's just doing the splits, being a badass. Thanks for donating again, uh, Colby. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate that. I want you guys to not eat a lot of food because of that. And a silly cobra, this little silly string fucking Pokemon. It looks so sad again. Why is it so fucking sad? I guess it's silly string, so yeah. I'd be sad I'm silly string, just saying. A reverse hollow Fomantis. And again, the simple yes! art stuff, I love it. This is like stuff you can see, like, you know, when you're like coloring in for the kids, like, here's all the green, here's all the mountains, like, I like that shit. I like that aesthetic, you know? That aesthetic is like pretty much what comes down to Pokemon. It's just, it's just people putting in colors around it and calling it a day. So it's pretty good. And again, Fomantis is just a Mantis Pokemon, you know? Scyther? Whatever. Scyther, get out of here. You got Fomantis, bro. And then you got a yes! holographic Entei. Nice! Two hollows already. We got two hollows already, guys. Holy shit. Nice. I don't know about you guys, but I love Entei. Entei, I mean, I'm a sweet coon guy, because that's like Gen 2. 
But Entei was like the, one of the main characters of Pokemon 3. Entei? Like Entei was like the main like the main villain basically. So flame on bro, flame on! And this Entei looks badass. Look at this. Again, the dog Pokemon, I enjoy. I enjoy the fires. <laughs> Hell yeah. Thanks for joining in, guys. If you're tuning in right now, I'm Kenny Boulder. Thanks for joining in. Uh, we're pack number two right now. So this is pack number two's hollow. Volcano Pokemon. Nice. And again, it's pretty good. What villain? More like a tragic hero. Oh. Oh, you're right. It is a tragic hero. He's such a tragic hero. Look. Gudan, welcome back. Look, I found your favorite Pokemon. It's Cutman. Look, Cutman. Gudan. Cutman, he's here for you, fam. <laughs> I don't know why I did an Asian accent. That was weird. Um, yeah, Entei's dope. I love it. I love it. Love it. So we got two hollows so far, and we still got six packs to open, guys, which is pretty baller. <laughs> pretty baller. All right, next pack. This Trinitar. Let's go. We want the Trinitar. We want the Trinitar. We want the thick, happy Trinitar. Unknown were the real villains. I mean, yeah, dude. Unknown were the real villain villains for sure. In Pokemon Three movie. Will you ever do a live pack opening in a Pokemon store? Yes! I should definitely do that. I'll bring my I'll, I'll bring my GoPro, I'll bring everything, yeah. I'll do that. When things are opened up. And also, oh chat, I got I got big news today. Got big news. Got big news. And it ends with seam. Alright, let's go. Pack number three of the night, y'all. Pack number three, let's go. Pokemon store. If I ever go to like Japan, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to the Pokemon store. I'm gonna go find the Pokemon cafe, open cards there and shit. <laughs> Cause I'll be a child. I'll just open Pokemon cards like random places, you know? I'll just go to like uh, like uh, the museum or something. Just start opening Pokemon cards and start live streaming. That'd be so j jank. <laughs> That'd be so scuff, dude. Just be like, guys, 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 shut the fuck up. I'm opening Pokemon cards. Oh, oh, it's a Charizard. It's a Charizard. Just people looking at me. It's like, what the fuck's going on? Just go to like uh, the police station or something. Huh, huh, Charizard, Charizard! Oh, so scuffed, so scuffed. Uh, green energy, or sorry, leaf energy. Sorry, leaf. Leaf energy. Uh, car coal. This is a cart full of coal with a face on it. Uh, making this is probably interesting because, you know, coal is like the fossilized remains of like plants from like Jurassic times. So this guy literally is just dinosaur poop. A live dinosaur poop with a face on it. Okay, sure. Uh, you got a pig knight. Oh, look at that big guy. He is having a good time. Single strike version, by the way. Single strike. Yeah, I always mention that. And look at all those dishes. It's like some Studio Ghibli shit right here. You know what I mean? Like, he's had his good time. All, all the, you know, he ate all the spirit food. And he's just, he's just happy. Just a happy little piggy over here. I mean, I, I definitely feel like that too. I ate all that food. Just saying. Uh, you got ourselves a fan of waves. Rapid Strike Edition. Uh, it's a, just a wave, you know? Just smile and wave, boys. Smile and wave. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? Nice. You got ourselves a Spoink. Spoink with the glistering lights around him. You know, I think it's like standing over water or something. Uh, yeah, I can't read that. Uh, Oji-san. Uh, you know, Oji-san is our resident Japanese weeb. Sorry, not weeb. Uh, Japanese culturally sensitive. Not sensitive. Cult Japanese culturally uh, informative person. There you go. Informative. Spoink is very cute. Love it. Next is going to be a bronzer. This is literally just a bronze Pokemon. Yeah, bronze Pokemon. So he just, it literally just says they're bronze. He's bronze with a face. I wonder what happened to bronze are during the bronze age collapse. Like, did these guys just disappear, you know? That's a dumb joke. I'm sorry. <laughs> The Bronze Age Collapse, lol. Uh, next is gonna be a Tepig. Oh, with his homie! Look at that, his homie! That's so cute. Uh, single, single Strike Edition. Uh, homie helping him get tough. This Tepig is like being a baller. Lol, Bronze Age Collapse joke one. <laughs> I mean, that's what I gotta do. That's so cute. I don't know why, but seeing like the evolution of him, like helping him like push things is like so wholesome. It's so wholesome. It's just he's just helping pushing like the, the the wood. He's just breaking the wood for his homie. Yo yo, I I this guy respect respect for you fam respect. Uh, another uh, pa Pachirisu Pacha Pachirisu Pachirisu very close enough. Uh, Mindful again with the splits. Yes. And a reverse hollow, Jellicent. I've never seen this before. 
I mean, again, I love the reverse all art, but like, what the fuck is this? Is it, is it like a squid Pokemon? No, it's a jelly Pokemon, okay? It's a floating Pokemon jellyfish. That is terrifying. Is it like this thing's like crawling out? Like this guy, there's like a person there. You can, you can see it kind of. He's like fishing and he gets one. And there's like a bunch around him. This guy's dead. He's fucking dead, dude. These things are out to kill him. Like, the, the, these things are prowling to murder this fucking Pokemon fisherman. Because, you know, 300 pounds of fucking pain. Holy shit. That's terrifying. And last but not least, we got a... Yes! Full Art Flapple V. Let's go. Three in a row. Wait, wait, we got three in a row. Um, uh, Hollows. Jesus. Another, another, another... Yeah. Oh, my God. Watch, the next pack's just gonna be dog shit. But hey, there you go. We got a little Mantis fucking Pokemon. Spewing some, like, fucking acid in your face. This is like that scene in Jurassic Park with the raptors, you know what I mean? Like, the raptors, like, spew, like, acid in people's faces. Like, this is what it reminds me of. It, it, even though it's, like, an apple Pokemon, like, this is terrifying, dude. I'm wandering around, it's like... <laughs> So three hollows so far, chat. We're we're doing pretty good. Not gonna lie, we're doing really good actually. This is uh pretty good. Again, first pack we're saving for last. All right, pack number four, chat. Number four. Sorry, I gotta fix this. Pack number four. Okay. Let's go. Pack number four of the night. Diamond poles. Diamond hands. Diamond poles for sure, fam. <laughs> Let's go, let's go. All right, let's go, let's see what we got here. Sorry, I'm having a hard time opening these things. Pack number four, the Battle Styles Elite Trainer Box. Let's see if we can get, this, this is probably not gonna be a fucking uh, hollow. All right, you got a uh, Energy Energy, kidding, Lightning Energy. Got Durant, again, terrifying little ant Pokemon that weighs 78 pounds. Uh, you got Camping Gear, because, you know, all of these Pokemon trainers are out there, and they got they need, they need their camping gear. If you don't have a camping gear, you're, you're basically sleeping on some, like, leaves and shit, man. Uh, you got ourselves a Haunch Crow. Dang, look at this. He's a thick boy. Holy smokes. He's, you know, browsing his wing out there, you know what I mean? Jeez. <laughs> That's very cool. I, I like I like like the rainbow color in the background. It's just, I enjoy it. It's trippy as hell. You know, and Honcho with the with the hat and with the trees around it. Definitely a terrifying Pokemon. And Samina. Yeah, definitely. So this Pokemon, this is what you see when you're like unable to fall asleep. You just wake up screaming to like a fucking Honch crow running around. Uh, you got a horsey again with the water. You got a Mankey. <gasps> Monkey. Return to monkey, return to monkey, ho 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 ho. Uh, single strike edition. <laughs> single strike monkey. And again, just just a fucking monkey, dude. What, what monkey? Sorry, it's a monkey. Monkey. Monkeys. <laughs> Monkeys for life, fam. For life. Look at this guy. He's just on the middle of fucking nowhere, just ready to kick some ass. A pig monkey Pokemon. I guess it is like a pig. I never, I never thought about that. That monkey is a pig. Hmm. Shit, you learn stuff every day that Mankey is actually a pig Pokemon. I thought he was just a monkey, you know what I mean? Uh, Mawile, single strike edition. Mawile is terrifying. Those like horns or not, sorry, teeth. If it's like a plant with teeth on it, like I just can't, you know? Like that's just, that's scary, fam. Mawile, you're, you're you're terrifying. I would not fuck with you, fam. Especially as you're a Steel type, you mess my shit up. For Mantis. A Reamoid, uh, Rapid Strike Edition, and look at that, that's so cute! Oh my god, there's his evolution too, they're just like, playing with the water! He has like, three different things on the background over here, look, look, he's like, Yo, what's up fam? I see you're, uh, trying to, you know, sip up your game here, let me show you my game. That's so cute! Spewing like, some like, sticks and stones, you know, like, oh my god. Obviously the, um, Octili Octopus Man has like, three, but like, that's impressive. That's impressive. Like, this is cool, but that's, like, impressive, too, you know what I mean? So, nice. Uh, next is gonna be a yes! Verse Hollow Buffalant. Skull Buffs? Can I get a Skull Buffs here in chat, y'all? Skull Buffs? 
Uh, again, it's just like a buff, you know, a buff, a giant buffalo Pokemon. You know, ox, bison, whatever you want to call it. It's a bison sometimes. And those horns, pretty cool. Hooves, awesome. And yeah, skull buffs. Yeah, skull buffs. Let's go. Oh my god, thank you, chat. Appreciate it, fam. Last but not least is a non holographic elect electivy. So, this uh, guy is an evolution of Electabuzz, and he is scary. He's basically this like fucking prowling Sully character from Monsters University. If Sully was like a yellow electric monster, this is what he would look like. So, yeah. Not bad. I mean, again, we can't get always hollows, guys. We have to uh, conserve the hollows for some fun treats. All right. Pack number five of the night with our bear boy again. Let's go. Ooh, that's a nice sound right there. Sorry, I gotta rip it up a little bit. All right, forward to the front. Energy, nice. Oh, sorry, uh, rock energy. And you got a single strike mustard. What? Single straw. Single style. Jesus Christ, I can't read. Single strike style mustard of the single strike edition. <laughs> This guy looks like, I don't know how to describe, he looks like uh, an anime character, you know what I mean? Like, an old sage in the middle of the mountains. Yeah, mustard. Listen, that's what it says, mustard. Why is he mustard? Maybe he has like yellow right here, and he's wearing his like, you know, his... <laughs> he looks like a Slavic man with his jumpsuit. Oh my god. Oh shit. Johnny, Johnny my boy, Johnny. Yo, welcome to uh, my channel guys from Johnny's Stream. I'm Kenny Boulder. Thank you so much for the raid, holy shit. And guys, um, check out Johnny's channel, please. That's awesome that you're stopping by, my guy. Uh, let me uh, give you a shout out real quick. Sorry, I got He's slob like me? Yeah, dude, he's definitely slob like you, bro. Thank you so much, Johnny. I really appreciate the raid. Thank you so much, my guy. Appreciate it. Full art, secret rare, so cool. Uh, we'll find out soon, uh, Justice. Thanks for stopping by, guys. Uh, I'm Kenny Boulder. Uh, please consider giving him a follow. I make. Oh my God! Uh, thank you so much, Bubble Bubbles likes cats. I really appreciate the follow. We're so close to our 200 follower uh, event special. So no, no, guys. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you, guys. Check out Johnny. He's awesome. He's amazing. Oh my God, the zoologist. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. You guys are humbling me right now in the stream. So check it out, guys. Uh, check out Johnny if you can. So I appreciate you stopping by. Raid hype better late than never? I no, dude, always hype. So we got mustard, our mustard boy, who looks like a Slavic man. You got Golbat, nice. You know, that's, that's a big mouth. Also, if you're joining the stream, uh, you're, we're on pack number four, or sorry, number five of the Battle Styles Elite Trainer Box. And so far, we got some hits so far. We got a three hollows. We got Octillery. We got Entei. And we got ourselves a Flapple V full art. So we have three hits so far, and we still got a couple more packs left. So you guys join in the middle of it. Thank you for joining, and thank you for so much for the follows and the raid as well. Mustard hype. Let's go. Let's go, Mustard. All right, that's Goldback. Goldback, he's a big mouth. That's all I got to say. Gen 1, big mouth. <laughs> and bats are fucking cool, I guess, because Batman. Uh, you got a Bruno. Bruno Single Strike Edition. Like, imagine this. You're just wandering around. Dude, nice. Nice. Fuck yeah. Well, hopefully this last pack here, the first pack of the night, we'll get one of those uh, full arts as well. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Thanks to, again, my dude, we went to another Zar tonight. Let's go, let's go see another Zar, y'all. Hell yeah. Sending them good vibes. Bruno's awesome, he's thick, he's juicy. You know, there's not much else to say about this guy. Um, we got Cubone. Oh, fingers, uh, yeah, let's go, let's go. Give me, the, give me that magic, fam. Uh, Cubone here, nice. He's just here with his bones, wearing the skull of his mother. I want that Trinitar so bad. I want that Trinitar. Uh, he's just sad. Holy shit. Just a sad boy. Uh, next is going to be a Ponard. Nice. Ponard, there you go. Good day. You got your pre-evolution of uh, Cutman. Ponard is basically Cutman Jr. And he is adorable. Hey, thank you so much for stopping by the Wills, man. I really appreciate that. Who would win Charizard or Donkey Kong? Dude, Charizard all the way. Donkey Kong got monkey energy, but Charizard got fucking nuclear breath. Oh, look at that, though. Again, I, I, I like the cup Pokemon. It's like, you know, it's, like, it's, 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 it's a Mega Man character. It's a Mega Man character. 
Uh, next to the guy is Houndor. Nice, Houndor is carrying that nice big stone because it's trying to grow up to be a uh, you know a big a big doggy. So let's let's find out if we can do that. So Houndor is classic. Guy Shinx. Oh wait, Shinx. Oh, I forgot to mention Houndor Single Strike Edition. We have to say that that's part of the gimmick of this channel. Single Strike, and then a Shinx Rapid Strike Edition. And this boy is this you know this little cute little fellow is just dancing on some stone. Okay, that's fucking adorable. I don't know y'all, but. That is so kawaii. He's just chilling. He's just going all on the fucking rocks. That's cute. Uh, I love that. I love. I love the you know the the, the determination in his eyes. Actually, if I go watch the Godzilla movie, dude, watch it. Check it out. I, I'm gonna watch it tomorrow. So, Johnny, thank you so much for the raid again. And please, guys, check out Johnny's channel. He's also a a fellow Colorado streamer to be exact. And Johnny, my guy, my guy, my guy. I I, I gotta share this link for you, dude. Uh, there's a Walmart I live nearby. And uh, it was insane. It was insane, bro. You have, you have to check this out. If you guys haven't had a chance yet, I also make a YouTube channel. And uh, last week was insane. It was insanity. Uh, literally, it was like a, a fight, guys. A fight at Walmart. It was actually insane. So check it out, guys. Please. It's. I mean, don't check it out. But, you know, I, I want to self-promote my channel. But, like, it's crazy. It is a crazy event to happen. So, uh, <laughs> again, literally... Nine dudes or 13 dudes all over a Walmart crate and they're fighting over a Walmart like Pokemon sports cards fighting over and you can see me you can see me by the way and I only got Pokemon cards so I'm not a scalper so fuck the scalpers oh thank you so much Kenson Th thanks for stopping by what a homie Kenson's my favorite mod he's my favorite mod in the entire galaxy and holy shit we're at 18 viewers Holy shit. Um, guys, thanks for joining the channel. I really appreciate it. I know we had 18 people watching tonight. I'll stop fucking around. <laughs> uh, so anyway, we, Shinx, cute. He's adorable. I love him. Next is going to be a Gilgar. Nice. Little flying uh, scorpion, right? He's a scorpion. I think he's a scorpion. Hmm. He's a terrifying little guy. And Oh, sorry. Yeah, flying scorpion type. There you go. And I don't know. He's just flying around. Like, can you imagine, like, Scorpion that fly? Like, that is terrifying. If I saw a flying Scorpion, I'd fucking run, you know? Like, I... I'd... <laughs> I choose you, Pikachu! Oh, shit, it's a Scorpion! Uh, you're, you're screwed! You know, like, I mean, again, the valley, I like the art. You know, I don't know why a Scorpion would be pink, though. He looks like Batman, you know what I mean? Like, a Batman, like, I, I know he's a Scorpion, but still. Oh, dude, yeah, nice. Oh, I'm glad he's you're one of your favorite OG Pokemon. So there he is, Flying Scorpion Pokemon. So there he is. Uh, next is going to be a Hol yes! Reverse Hollow Golbat. Scorpion Fly is a real thing. That's terrifying. Fuck that. Uh-uh. Nope, not not today, Jesus. Uh, Golbat is adorable. And by adorable, I mean terrifying. And again, this Reverse Hollows, they're pretty cool. Pretty good stuff. Uh, next is gonna be a non-holographic stone jar, which is not bad. Single strike edition. Again, we gotta say it. Single strike. And this guy's shooting late. Oh no, he's stomping on things. That's why there's like lasers coming out. And this thing looks like a stone hedge. Okay, I get it. Stone hedge. You know, big rock Pokemon. Stony. Yeah, I get it. Uh, he looks pissed off. Holy shit, look at that face. <laughs> look at this dude's face. Look at this dude's face. <laughs> this looks so dumb. Sorry, I can't take this Pokemon seriously. All right, guys, we got three packs left. Pack number six of the night with our bird, or not bird, holy shit, with our bear Pokemon in the front. And let's go. Another pack, y'all. Open you up. Four to the front. Okay, we got fire energy. We got a Purgly, this little tiger cat Pokemon. Why is it a tiger cat? Like, wh what? Aren't cats basically like felines and shit? You know what I mean? Uh, and the Chungus, 96 pounds. Okay, this definitely has like a bobcat or something, I guess. Okay, that's fair. It's like a bobcat, like tiger of sorts. Definitely interesting. Okay, okay. I like that. I like that look, you know. Sassy. I enjoy the little tail thing. And, you know, cats are adorable. I'm a cat guy. I, I, what can I say? Cats are cool. Uh, you got Tower of Darkness, Single Strike Edition. Uh, Thick Cat. Uh, again, why is it a Tower of Darkness, though? 
I guess it's like spooky. It's no like the, like a mount or something you know, on top. So that definitely could be full of darkness and adventure. You got a girder holding, you know, holding some fucking steel beams. <laughs> girder is like a weird Pokemon. I don't know why, but Girder is like just like, like uh, he's like he doesn't even have legs. He has like stumps for legs, and he's like super swole. Like I guess he's like construction worker. You know what I mean? He's just running around, ripping shit apart and stuff. Uh, next you got here is Esper. Oh, Esper's so cute. God damn, I love Esper so much. Esper's like a cute Pokemon. Top, top, top twenty for sure. Okay, top twenty because it's so goddamn cute. Like look at those eyes. Those eyes have seen some shit. You know what I mean? So, love the art style, love the things in the back, it's like floating around, it's a cute little, cute little cat creature thing. Blip bug, blip bug with a bow tie, and the glasses, again, what a fucking nerd this guy is, nah, I'm kidding, I love nerds. Blip bug, blip bug, blip bug, they're a lar larva Pokemon. Yep, grown people fighting over Pokemon. It's just because they only see money, not collection. I sell packs, yes, but I also collect them. I'm not going to punch someone over cardboard. Dude, dude. I, I I get that, fam. I get that. And obviously, like, you know, Walmart, Barnes & Nobles, GameStop, they put all the product in the back. For whatever reason, Walmart, we're going to put everything in a crate. You know, a cart, sorry, and put it in front of all the fucking crazy people. And like, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna be honest, I'm gonna, I'll be real here, like, a lot of these people who come, they're not even from the area. They literally drive 45 minutes to an hour from like, South Denver, all the way up north, to go get these cards, so, it's crazy man, I hate it. And, okay, no shaming fam, no shaming. Like, if you sell cards, that's fine, not a big deal, but if you're selling just to make money, that's, that's where it's like stupid man. Like, you're gonna sell, and you're gonna, like, take it out of fans of fans, you know what I mean? And, you know, I get it. <laughs> I get it, you know, the economy's tough and stuff, but still, it's pretty fucked up. Uh, next card's gonna be a silly, a silly, a silly Cobra. Again, Silly String Cobra, nice. Uh, Houndour, Single Strike Edition. Again, I love the fucking, like, just carrying the goddamn stone. Uh, dude, yeah, limit, limit, limits, please, limits, limits. Like, three per customer, one per customer, you know, I just want something, okay? I, I don't I don't give a shit what it is, I just want something, anything. So, yeah, absolutely. Scalpers, man, fuck scalpers. Uh, next card is gonna be a lick a tongue, nice, nice, you got a lick a tongue, you got a lick a lick a lick a lick a lick a lick a uh, You got a reverse hollow, Conkledur. Yes. That's, a, that's, a, that's a stupid fucking name, man. Conkledur. <laughs> Conkledur. Conkledur. I don't, I don't get that. That's so dumb. That's so dumb. What the fuck is this? He's a muscular Pokemon. His legs now. Okay. So Girder grew legs and got some hands and fingers and shit. He's so dumb looking. What the fuck is this? Oh man. Blech. That's disgusting. I'm sorry, I just had to saw that chat. Mm. I mean, he's a small guy. He's a, two, almost 200 pounds. Holy shit. 200 pounds of fucking muscle, man. Okay, if I see this guy, I would, I would run for sure. Last but not least is a... Wow! Oh, incredible! Shit. A full art rainbow Corviknight VMAX. Chat, we fucking got a full art rainbow VMAX fucking secret rare Pokemon. Let's fucking go. Holy shit. God damn. Oh my god. What a fucking pull, my guys! What a fucking pull! Holy shit! Sorry, I gotta put this away real quick, chat. It's beautiful. Oh my god, uh, Zesh Ketchum, thank you so much for the follow, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for the follow, fam. Oh my god, look at that! Holy shit, chat! That's a, that, that, that's a pretty fucking bird, okay? That's a pretty fucking bird for sure. He is a VMAX card of evolution, and he is one of the cards that... Um, I mean, he's not a trainer card, don't get me wrong, but he is still cool. I don't have this yet, so... Obviously, this is an awesome pull for sure. And, uh, yeah, no, it's beautiful. It's fucking beautiful. I've gotten about five Rainbow Rares total, and this is number five, I think, number six. So, uh, pretty cool card. The centering is good. Uh, PSA 10, even though they're not even taking any cards anymore. So PSA Ripperoni if you want to get some cards graded. 
And uh, yeah, no, this is awesome, guys. Look at that. That's a sick card. You can see the glistering glitter around it all over. And it's legit. It's legit, guys. I mean, yeah, wow. I'm happy. I mean, what can I say? Elite Trainer Boxes, they're, you know, you get some good pulls. So, Johnny, thank you. This is all you guys. Y'all here giving me good vibes. Making me get pull some good cards, boys. Hey, I'm out. Hey, hey, hey. You take care, Johnny. And obviously, yeah, on Saturday. Check him out, guys. Check out check out Johnny, please. Johnny's a great guy. He's a fellow Colorado streamer. So let's go. Let's go. All right. We have two packs left. Two packs left in the night. Two packs left, okay? So pack number uh, seven right here. Let's go. We want that. We... You know, we, we want the Trinitar, but I'm happy. I got I got I got more than I wanted. Holy shit. Let's go. I want you especially oh my god. Okay, okay. I'll see what I can be, man. I'll see. I'll try to get there. I, I have some plans this weekend, but I'll see if I can make it. I'll stop by for sure. Alright, force to the front. Okay, we got a psychic energy. Got a, a fucking a trippy ass grum pig. Dang. What the hell is this? This is so trippy! Oh, what the fuck is this, dude? I just... I don't get the art style. Like, someone was like, okay, I want you to make Grumpig. And the person was like, okay, I'll make Grumpig. And it did acid. And it fucking did this. Like, it is fucking terrifying. Oh, Gudan, thank you so much for uh, donating to the Mukbang Challenge. I appreciate that, my guy. Uh, Grumpig is just trippy as fuck, dude. Look at that. It's just... It's just it's stupidly trippy for whatever fucking reason. It's so dumb. Uh, next is gonna be a Luxio Rapid Strike Edition. You got a Spewpa, nice. Oh, good in. Check this out, dude. Look at this shit. Secret Rare Rainbow. Not Secret Rare. It's just, it's just a rainbow card. Corviknight V Max, baby. Let's go. Uh, again, he's just he's just a little cute guy. I love it. I love this like eyes and shit, and, like hiding around this like bush of like love. So it's cute. It's a cute Pokemon. Horsey again. Got a Mankey single strike edition. Galarian Slowpoke. And apparently the reason why it's Galarian is because it has a yellow forehead and a yellow tail. Which doesn't mean much, I guess. But hey, I mean it's 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 a it's a form of being unique, I guess. It just changed the forehead or the tail. Uh you got yourselves a Fomantis again. A Rimroid. Rapid strike again with his octopus bro in the back and the little Sticks and stones in the back there. Very cute. And then a yes! reverse hollow single strike scorn. Sorry, sorry, scroll of scorn with that 10 damage because it's a trainer card that attacks things, which is fucking bonkers. So, again, pretty cool. Last but not least, we got ourselves a non holographic sazzle, which is fine because we got a fucking banger just now. So, not a bad pull. Sazzle is a cute little Pokemon. Nothing wrong with it. Apparently it's actually a fucking big lizard Pokemon. A toxic lizard. Okay, you're, this, this guy's toxic, bro. He's a toxic Pokemon. So, a toxic Pokemon here. And then you got our last pack of the night, chat. With our Club Penguin Pokemon. So, last pack of the night. Let's go. I feel it, guys. I feel something good in here. Let's go. <laughs> we always say the first for last. You know what I mean? That's how we do it here in, in Kenny Boulder's channel. Oh my god. Let's go. Alright. Last pack magic. Or first pack magic if you want to think about it. Taps? Alright, alright. Here's the taps. Here's the taps for you, Johnny. Tap, tap, tap. Alright. Three or four to the front. And there's the last card. Taps. We want, we want the taps here. Johnny says taps and uh, Zatch Ketchum Man says taps. Well, I'll do it. I'll do it, fam. For you. Electric Energy. Fear Crow. Nice. You got Fear Crow finally. Uh, you know, it's just a ballistic card. I like that. It's just, you know, you color it in, you call it a day, walk out. Easy. Fear Crow, Gen 1 Pokemon. Love it. Escape Rope. Hey, 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 if you're in a, in, you know, in, you know, playing Pokemon, and you're in some caves, and you got Escape Rope, you're good to go. I love it. Escape Rope is great. You always need Escape Rope, fam. Always. Lick it for luck? I'm not gonna lick it. <laughs> it's so it's so eerie. I didn't, I didn't like it actually. <laughs> uh, Escape rope. Uh, trippy as fuck. Grumpug. 
you know, again, the trippiness is wild. Galarian Mr. Mime. See, you guys, we're all fucking clowns, okay? Again, that Walmart video, I'm going to the same Walmart tomorrow, by the way. I'll be real with you. And I probably wear a GoPro. Uh, we're, they're, they're all clowns. We're all fucking clowns running around ice. Because everyone's going to fight for fucking Pokemon cards. For literally cardboard. So, you know, people are crazy. And I don't know why, but Glaring Mr. Mime, I think it's cooler. I just think it is. I like the blue. I like the, you know, the frost aesthetic of Mr. Mime, you know? So, I respect that. I respect Mr. Mime. You got ourselves a Fomantis. Spear Crow? Or Spear, Spear Crow, Jesus. Uh, uh, a, oh, look at that! A Zubat that's like crocheted or like, you know, the hyper realistic Pokemon, y'all, chat? I love it. I just love this fucking art style. I just love it so much. It's just like someone put time and energy and made something beautiful and then they made a picture of it. Like, literally, this background's probably like, you know, the background, like a cardboard, but like, this thing's real and it's so fucking cool. Even though it's a bat, I hate bats, but you know, it's cool. Got a Cubone again, you know, holding Mama's fucking left leg. And a Reverse yes! Hollow, Electabuzz. Actually, I think we even got one of these earlier. Interesting. And then last card of the night. Here's the taps, y'all. The taps, I licked it. Electabuzz. Show me what you got, fam. A non-holographic Sazzle again. Womp womp. That's fine, though. We got this guy. We got a rainbow card tonight, y'all. So our pulls tonight, Cor Corviknight VMAX, Flapple V, Entai, Octil or Octillery. So all good, all good. All good for the night, y'all. So we're gonna go back into the big screen. Nice. So guys, I'm Kenny Boulder. And again, thank you so much for joining. And again, guys, if you haven't, haven't yet, check out Johnny Zillow, 5280. Again, 5280, he's a Colorado, one mile up. And he's all awesome. He's, one, he's a Colorado streamer like me. So, uh, again, I want to give a shout out to all my fans, oh, wow, fans, to all my followers and my subscribers. Again, this is for 350 subscribers. And it's, it's, it's awesome. I mean, I, I've gotten a lot of views in the past few days, and it's been incredible. Because, obviously, like, this is what you want. I mean, this is a hobby for me. I'm doing this as a hobby. And, uh, yeah, the big news. I got my vaccine. I got, I got, I got, I got a nice shot right here. Oh, baby, it hurts like, it's so sore now. I can't. Oh, there you go. There's the band-aid. I got my vaccine and uh, things are looking good. So obviously, I, I, you know, be safe, guys. If you're out for Pokemon cards, be safe. It's not worth your life for some cardboard. Like, I plan to wear my GoPro just because, you know, I want to get some footage. And oh my god, Johnny, you're a fucking homie, dude. I fucking, what a fucking homie. Uh, but anyway, guys, please, please consider following me on Twitch. Follow me on, uh, or sub on uh, YouTube. I also made a TikTok recently, uh, Kenny Boulder on TikTok. I think I got 10K views in like 48 hours. It's kind of crazy, not gonna lie. But no, thank you so much for watching my content and you have a great night. So take care always and maybe this hair might be gone now, just saying. Next time fam, yay!